Hey everybody, my name is Kinder Mom, welcome back for another video of Age of History 2. We're going to continue this series, boys. In the last video, we continued our expansion in the south a little bit. And uh, now we're about to end, uh, basically, uh, our turn, right? We're about to end our turn with the Asian territory uh, for now. Once we get to our turn 100, 100, which is about like 22 turns or something, or 32 turns, I'm not sure. It's uh, very not. It's really not far uh, that far out. We're gonna do it in this video. We're gonna switch to African land. I'm not too sure which one I'm gonna choose just yet. I might choose one of those uh, right here, or I might just choose Rome because technically Rome now is a uh, 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 African territory. Now it's an African territory only, so uh, we might choose that. I'm not sure, boys. We'll see. But for right now, we gotta re continue to focus on our war effort over here against the Mongolians. That's about the only thing we gotta do, really. So let's do that. Let's send all my little reinforcements over here. We're gonna send you over there. We're gonna try and finish that war as quickly as possible so we can do other stuff than, than just being at war with them for the remaining turns, boys. So we're gonna try our best right here. Let's go ahead and invade all these places. We did take Beijing. Uh, 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 video boys I, I did take it just because I had to save the game so I had to actually skip a turn in order to save the game so uh, I did it um, now let's see where this is gonna land us eventually Beijing I want it to be my capital but I don't think it's gonna be a it's gonna be possible boys especially with um, the the limited amount of territories I uh, allow myself to take uh, every wars I can only take about 10 uh, provinces per country, boys, per turn, uh, per, uh, per uh, idea. So the truce has expired with the Han Dynasty. So we can actually go after the Han Dynasty afterwards if we want to. But might be tempted to just clean that up right there, the Qing Empire. I don't want that, uh, that in my territory, boys, that's for sure. So 68%. You can see that there's not a whole lot we can do now. There's less and less uh, technology research. We've got so much territory that we can't do as many as many research as we wanted to uh, early earlier on. So I, I guess that's okay. We gotta expect that at some point. But let's go over here with this army. Uh, you are just gonna focus your effort. You're gonna go in that direction. You are gonna go over there, I guess. No, you're gonna go there. There we go. And uh, let's bring you up to notch right there. And I guess. You can start going south because there's nothing we can really do with you. And uh, that's about it. I don't have anything else going on. Let's just skip the turn. We are going to go super fast on that one. They don't. The Mongolians are basically defeated right now. It's just a matter of me actually taking all the territories they've got. So let's just do that really quick. I'm going to keep that guy. Actually, no. I got I to gotta put them all together right here. So let's put uh, this guy over here in the south. We are going to send him over here. And uh, you are going to go there and you're going to invade that one. And uh, same thing for you, buddy. I guess I guess I got to move you up right there. And for him, I guess I got to put it at 669. That's uh, we got an extra point. Let's put it on colonization once again. There we go, boys. And uh, let's do our thing. Let's skip the turn, boys. There we go. Keep it invading all our territories. Now they've got two territories left. So it's pretty much over boys they're done with we uh, we defeated them at this point let's see what we got what we can do with, uh, with this right here uh, we're just gonna go ahead and invade the last two remaining territories they've got I'm gonna uh, select these two and put them together I guess I need to reform my armies together and stuff let's put it uh, this guy right here okay let's see we're about to to finish it off boom and boom just like that so we are in turn 82, year 533 uh, uh, 530, uh, as well, boys. We can actually start investing a little bit more, 73% uh, now, so good. And now we are going to go here. We got 100% a score. And let's go, go do the peace negotiations, boys. Now, I'm tempted to just go actually in the south this time around, uh, or the north this time around, which is... I think it's what I'm gonna do. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, I'm gonna take all of these territories right there, and the rest I'll liberate it like uh, like last time. 
So let's see who can we liberate right here. Demand vassalization. Let's do my thing really quick. All right, boys. So what we're going to do, I guess I can't actually do anything with that. I can only take these territories right here. So I'm going to do that. I'm also going to demand their, um, them to be a puppet of mine. And the, the rest is just going to be warp reparations. So just ask them to be my puppet and then do the war reparations and everything. So let's do the demands. We are going to be have the truce for 50 turns. Let's do that, boys. Ask for that. And we're going to see, I guess, each other for the next turn right here. There's not much else we can really do about this whole situation. Uh, I can, however, send these guys over here and try and reconnect all of them together and stuff. Uh, I'm going to keep that guy over there, I guess. If I can, actually, this might be Mongolian territory, so I might as well just move him. All right, let's see what, uh, what's going to happen. There we go. There's the truce, boys. So the Mongolian is very much still alive, I guess, unfortunately. But they are now my puppet. They're in my sphere of influence. So um, I've got them as a puppet. So this is basically all of uh, me right there. Um, now, obviously, kind of want them to eventually release a vassal or something. Liberate a vassal? No, I don't want to liberate them, that's for sure. That would be a mistake. But um, right now, liberty to desire, 0%. Uh, Alright, so we got them as a vassal, I guess. There's not much we can do. We can only focus on the territories we did gain. So, uh, which are these ones. And we've got, like, a, 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 a door towards the, the north right here. Now, I'm not sure what I can do eventually, maybe, to, to get these guys. Uh, send an insult. I don't want to send an insult, but uh, offer an alliance. We can do an alliance of some sort. We can't because we're not going to accept. Um, they're pretty... Are they unhappy? No, they're happy with me, obviously. But um, support rebels, ask for military access. I'm not sure what to do here in order to, for me to actually form a union or something like that. I think that's the way I wanted to go. So maybe send a gift. I'm going to send some gifts. There we go. Send them over, send over some gifts uh, to them boys so that um, they're going to be happy with me. And I'm also going to improve relationships over time as much as possible. So eventually we can actually form a union, you know. That's what I'm going to try and do as much as possible. We also have a truce and all. So uh, we've got these guys in this territory. What I'm going to end up doing is I need to reform all of them together. I need to send them back into one single army. Uh, same thing for you. You just go over there, I guess. So, did we have... Do we have one of the territories I wanted uh, for a new capital and stuff? I don't think I did. I don't think I did, boys. This is a big one. Look at that. That's a metropole right there. Abba is turning out to be a metropole. I don't think I have the territories I want, though. The, the Qing place and stuff. No, I don't think it, it's the case. So, who are, are we at war with anybody? No, we're not at war with anybody just yet. It seems like the Z are at war with the Yan, though. So, that's going on right now. Okay, I guess that's I guess that's fine. We can also do some trades, I think, right? Trade requests. So, military access, uh, provinces. Oh, yeah, we can do some trades because they are, uh, they are friendly with me. So, I can always ask for extra territories, boys. So, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten right there. Let's ask for that, boys. So we can ask for that. And as well, what we're going to do is send them some gold, I guess. Send them all the gold in the pile in, in the world, I guess. That's, that that should work, right? Coordination, non-aggression pack. Let's, let's just do that. Send that proposal. They're probably going to accept. They should at least accept. That's for sure. Let me uh, get these guys over there. Okay, I think uh, we are good. Next up, we are going to need, obviously, some troops over here. So uh, everywhere we uh, we went, we just got again. I'm going to need to get some libraries and supply camps and everything. But also, we're going to need uh, some troops. So let's find out really quick. All right, so right now, I'm just uh, I finished up re working on the other cities. Right now, I'm just... I guess recruiting a bunch of soldiers on all the borders I've got uh, with other countries, including my puppet. Because it might be my puppet right now, but it's not always going to be the case, you know. It might be a problem eventually, so... Then we're going to try and mobilize as much as possible my armies right here. 
Uh, we do need to focus on this little effort right here. I'm going to keep going for 73%. I don't know if I can get more. It doesn't look like I can like declare war on anybody. I did want to go after the Chang next. I think that's one thing I wanted to go for. But I think I might actually leave them alone after all. Uh, I, I thought I would go after them if I actually gained uh, the, that territory. But it doesn't look like it's going to be the case. Uh, this time around so we're just gonna go ahead and colonize uh, an extra land right there boys let's colonize this place we're gonna get the supply camps the libraries and the port a uh, port actually right there that's interesting we got some ports okay let's skip the turn boys so that was a pretty long turn right here because of the uh, the peace the treaty and stuff but now we can actually go to 80 percent back uh, back to 80 percent which is very really good uh, they refused, they rejected the trade offer, so they don't want to give their territories just yet. Gifts sent back, uh, they don't want my gift either. So they're not very friendly with me, man. Okay, they're not very friendly with me. I'm gonna tell you, uh, I've, got a, I've got a truce with them for now. Uh, well, they do have war reparations uh, for me, and I got a truce for them for another 50 turns, so it's not like I can do anything. Uh, with them so uh, there's pretty much lost at this point I think how I'm gonna go I'm gonna go south now and I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask these guys to give me their territories so um, it's about time we may uh, may might start to actually go after these guys so let's send a bunch of insults towards these uh, these or uh, these ones uh, we are not gonna be able to send the ultimatum just yet though because we're pretty much sending all spending all our points Trying to insult them really quick, but we do. I would that we still have enough points to colonize one uh, area. So, just gonna colonize this one, I guess, right here. Uh, you're gonna be sent there because we don't need you to border anybody. We don't need any troops there. So libraries, farms, and everything. Okay, good. 80 80 percent. Next turn, just like that. We do have a point. Let's put it on colonization. We're now at five for colonization. Good. And uh, now we got 3.2. So now we can actually ask the chin. Uh, do an ultimatum on them, boys. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, I actually... Yeah, there we go. All of this. Give me all of this, buddy. And um, I'll go ahead and not invade you. How does that sound? There we go. That sounds perfect to him. Let's go, boys. So we've got uh, these extra territories like this, just like that. And that is perfect uh, right there. So... Let's get, I guess, some soldiers right there because we do need, we are bordering somebody. We are actually going to start working, obviously, uh, on the uh, on the places themselves. So supply camps, library, farms, ports if need be. But I don't think there's any ports that's going to be available right here. All right, I pretty much got everyone I needed to get. I'm going to reinforce with the soldiers that weren't bordering anybody. So let's reinforce over there. And I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, so now we got the south. We got this side right here. I'm not sure which one I'm going to go for next. I'm already assimilating these guys. So I'm not sure which one I'm going to go, boys, uh, for. But uh, I think... Uh, let's skip the next turn really quick. I think what I might do right here... Military access uh, expired with the Han Dynasty. And that's about it. Might go and try and defeat the Han Dynasty or take some territories from them once again. Uh, I'm not too sure how that's gonna work and um, I'm still probably gonna I think I don't really like having um, any vassals or anything so I'm gonna just I'm gonna liberate him because I don't like having vassals and stuff so you're free now all right you're free buddy just go I went ahead and liberated him and uh, now does we don't need to worry about him we still have a truce with them so I have uh, suspended relationships with the young for him uh, is there not a truce for me? I think I can actually boys. I can go back. Okay Well, I might do that then I just might keep going after him boys Because if I can go after him or actually not Wait, oh, oh because we got good relations uh, Let's just not have good relations in that case uh, Let's go ahead and do this right here. Let's keep doing uh, giving them insults boys just like that. One more insult, I guess. Just like that. And now we can send an ultimatum. Really? 
I, I guess I forgot to put the 50 turns on or something. I'm pretty sure I did, but one, two, three, four, five, uh, four right there, five, six, seven, eight, nine and uh 10 so you're gonna give me all these territories right there buddy all right all these territories right away you better give it to me give it to me buddy you already went tw twice at war with me yeah that's right that's what i thought that's what i thought the mongolians they just get accepted that so that's really good now we're gonna have an actual truce with them and uh we can actually start focusing on all, all of this on get assimilating all these territories. I'm going to get the farms, libraries, and everything over there. We are doing so good. I mean, I, I didn't think we were able to... We would be able to do so much with this little country in Asia, boys. I thought we would be able to create a little bit of, like, a, a Chinese empire of some sort. But not uh, going that far away? I never thought that would be possible, that's for sure. So, that is... That's truly crazy, and I, I love it. I mean, that's just proves how much, uh, e how easy this game I I truly is. Once you get the gist of it, you can basically do whatever you want, uh, really. You there's nothing stop that can really stop you when you know what you're doing. So, farms, libraries, and supply camps as the usual. I think I got pretty much everyone right there. Yeah, I think uh, unless unlike this one, it's the last one I didn't get. Just like that, there we go. And now we are gonna send some soldiers. Yeah, these troops, I gotta need I need them over there. So let's just send them, reinforce them, I guess. And same thing for you. Uh, I guess we're gonna move you to right there. Okay. And we do have some troops still right there, all right? Oh no, actually, oh, well, I don't know where my other troops went. I think they just automatically went back here, I guess. So. I guess uh, that's fine. We don't have anything uh, else that we need to do. Let's skip to the next turn, boys. So we're turn 89 right now. We do have a point that we just gained. Let's put it on income. I want uh, round numbers. So I want it to be at 15 instead of 13. Uh, we do still have some assimilating to do, it looks like. We didn't have enough points last time, in good, uh, maybe. There we go. Just like that. Now we're assimilating everybody, I'm pretty sure. So that's good. We're actually going to have to skip another turn again right here. Um, before doing that, though, I am going to go here, actually, and go there. Need to really make sure that everything's all right. And actually, I need to recruit some soldiers over there. Forgot about doing that. All right. Let's go for the next turn. There we go. Just like that. Yeah, we are assimilating everybody. So it looks like we're fine now. Uh, night, last time I went for the north. Now I'm going back into south. It doesn't look like they're at war anymore, these two. Uh, I think, yeah, they made peace. So they just took all of their territories except for one, I guess. So the Yan, uh, I'm going to go ahead and go after you now. Um, I'm sorry about that in advance, buddy, but I got to do what I got to do. I got to take these territories for myself, man. I got to expand. I got to go, I, like, I expand a very far west. I gotta expand into uh, in the east now a little bit, you know. I gotta take these things, so I'm gonna do just that. I'm gonna send an insult right here. So I'll send a bunch of insults once again, just to make sure, boys. All right, so I went ahead and uh, sent all the insults as possible. I'm down to 2.3, so I, I I'm I need one more point, like point one in order to actually do the ultimatum so I can't do it in this turn so we're just gonna start colonizing a little bit more uh, into the forest right here trying to actually move into um, uh, territory strange lands right here that we never saw before it's brand new lands boys for the Russian lands right there uh, we are gonna continue to go here actually oh, I don't have enough points okay that's fine let's get to the next turn there we go uh, let's go to 80% I am going to make sure that the, before ending the video that we do get uh, to the 100 and we actually switch uh, places. So let's go ahead and do this right here. Let's ask him for to give me that. Give me j uh, that and that's about it, buddy. I'm not going to ask for any more than that. Uh, let me get that territory right here, that forest territory. Uh, you've got some armies right here, I guess. Or maybe, you know what? I think I can disband the army. Yeah, I think that's what I can do. So, disband the army right here. All of it. Just disband the army right here. 
Same thing, well actually you can actually go sell there and re uh, reinforce so you can go da do that. But uh, over here, let's start uh, working on the farms and everything. Because I don't want, I don't want to have to deal with moving my armies every 5 seconds as well, you know. I don't want to have to deal with that so if I can just get rid of them altogether, that would save my, uh, me uh, some time quite, uh, quite a bit. So let's assimilate everybody once again. Uh, how f how good are we in terms of culture? Before that, uh, working on that though, let me just make sure to do these things really quick. Uh, let's get the soldiers right there. We're gonna reinforce with this army. Hold on. Okay, I'm still in the. There we go. I'm still in that mode. Let me reinforce on that side. There we go. I think we're good for the rest. Yep. So yeah, bef how are are we in culture right now? We have, most of our culture is doing pretty good actually, we're doing a good job with the simulating part. We do have still 38% of our culture uh, over the, the entire regions. The Han Dynasty has a little bit of culture on us, so does the Mongolian Empire, but for the most part we're doing pretty decent. We're doing alright, so don't need to, work, uh, to worry about anything really, we're doing just fine. Uh, Nyanghang would be a good uh, little place to get a, I guess, a new capital and stuff. Got another metropole right there, boys. So it's quite interesting. Yeah, um, I don't know where to go exactly. Which one I would want to get as a capital? I want eventually Beijing to be my capital. Uh, I think that would be the best option right here. Uh, we are still, we still need to do some stuff right here. I got plenty of points, so I went um, south. How many turns I've got against uh, these guys? I've got another 25 turns against the Mongolians. All right, so I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna ask for the Qing now. I'm gonna go after the Qing boys. I keep re uh, liberating a bunch of people, so they all are happy uh, with me and stuff because of that. That's not good for me. I want them to be mad at me so I can actually, you know, send some ultimatums and stuff. Let me do that. Colonize that territory right there. That's uh, a really good one. Let's do that. There's actually a lot of soldiers we can recruit from that as well, which is very good indeed. We got some supply camps and everything. Uh, we are already working on that. All right, good. We got an extra point right there. Let's put it at 15 for income taxation. Uh, let's put it at 80% over here. We got non-aggression pack with the Han Dynasty. Okay, hold on. The Han Dynasty wants a non-aggression pack, boys. Let's refuse that. Uh, I'm going to refuse, buddy. Just because I'm about to go after you right away. You're my next target. So yeah, I'm not going to I'm not gonna go after that. Uh, after the Qing, uh, you're going to be my next target. So the Qing, you're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm going to take all of your territories, buddy. Just like that. And we still got enough, just enough points to get one territory. So let's get that one right here. Just like that. And let's try and get the supply camps so the libraries and farms over there as well let's disband the army right here that's perfect let's skip the turn boys there we go just like that let's go at 80 percent right here so we've got an extra territory let me just go ahead and assimilate all of that right here so we just got all of it um, we annexed the chiang so really good in, in our part Let's just uh, actually reinforce on that side for this guy. We are going to work on the farms and everything for this one. We are getting there. We're turn 94, boys. In no time, we're going to be able to actually switch over to a different place. Uh, it's going to be quite interesting. I'm not sure where I'm going to go, to be honest. But uh, I'm very excited about this. So uh, we're, gonna, we're about to find out soon enough. All right, let's skip to the next turn, boys. Just like that, there we go, we're at 4.2. Um, the war reparations would expire in one turn for the Mongolians, so they won't have to pay me back. Uh, now we are going to go after the Han Dynasty. Once again, boys, we're going to try and push them to the, their limit right there. This looks ugly as hell, by the way. I really got to clean that up. I think at this point, I'm just going to go east versus west. So next part is going to be west, but... I still have a choice with the Mongolians. I'm going to go after the Han Dynasty now. And try and do an ultimatum on them. So, let's see if you're willing to give me some territories, buddy. 
So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You give me all of this. I'll leave you alone for a while, buddy. I'll leave you alone, all right? So just give me all of the everything that you got, buddy, and I'll leave you alone. Uh, colonize this place with the re remaining armies, of, uh, or not armies, but points that I had. Let's get the farms and everything, and destroy, disband this army right here. There we go, boys. And I think I'm already working on the 80%. Yes, we uh, we are. Let's see. They did accept. There we go. They accepted, boys. So we just annex a bunch of territories from the Han right here. Let's uh, get the assimilating done really quick. Just so it's done. I, I don't have enough points for one of those, uh, those territories. That's fine, though. We'll work on it eventually. Let's get the farms done and everything. All right, so I'm done uh, with all of it, boys. We've uh, working on the new provinces or regions that I've got uh, from that so I've got another four turns to go before ending uh, before ending our part in Asia for now so now that we got that done you're gonna hear my dog just doing his thing on the door and stuff he wants to to, uh, to go in but uh, can't allow him right, uh, right here boys can't make noise other than that so uh, he's gonna just have to stay outside for now uh, we uh, have 80%, so we don't have anything else to do. Once again, we got to skip another turn uh, really quick. There we go, just like that. We are uh, working on assimilating everybody. And uh, right now, it looks like our next focus is going to be on the west. Not too sure what I want to do. West slash north, I could always just spend all my points trying to colonize this. But I think I need to take out the as many color or as many uh, people as possible. So we're going to go after the Kanju right here. We're gonna go after them. We're gonna send them an ultimatum. There's two turns remaining, boys. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, ten. That was, there we go. Just like that. Let's expand as much, as further away as possible, boys. Let's see if we can do that. And at the same time, we're gonna colonize that, just to um, to get some extra soldiers and stuff. Let me disband this army actually right here, because I'm pretty sure they're gonna they're, they're probably gonna accept. So I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna need. Uh, need it or uh, and all so we're gonna be good on that part. And I think uh, that's pretty much it Let's skip to the next turn. All right, that's gonna be the last turn boys It's gonna be our last turn right here as these guys and they actually refused So that means we're gonna have to go to war with them. So I did not need to um, Get rid of them. I think I needed to actually get them after all so since they refused, it looks like we are going to declare war on them, boys. Looks like we're going to war. So let's go ahead and declare war on them really quick. Boom. And the Chang Empire, the biggest empire in the world, is about to invade Kanju, boys. Let's go to war. Uh, I don't have any troops there, though, unfortunately. But let's just do our thing, I guess. I'm going to have to send these guys over there. Reinforce with a couple of armies there here and here and there boys let's uh, do the same thing for here same thing for here I guess we're gonna keep reinforcing behind us just to make sure that everything's okay so yeah there we go just keep reinforcing right here and uh, same thing for you you're gonna go in that direction got a lot of troops available we gotta watch out man I'm ready I'm ready for my war in the west I can leave by a lot of troops now boys about a thousand troops for land which is very good indeed these guys are gonna regret um, actually refusing to to uh, to uh, my deal and stuff so they're gonna definitely regret it quite a lot now unfortunately I'm not the one who's gonna focus on that war though uh, it's gonna be mostly the um, the AI choosing what they're doing or what they're gonna do with it so uh, there's not much I can I'm gonna be able to do with that. I'm also gonna send this guy over there. There we go I mean look at all the reinforcers behind me that I'm sending right now. So that's a uh, that's quite a lot There's a bunch of thousands everywhere. They're gonna feel my wrath That's for sure boys. So we're gonna end it right here Let me go ahead and make sure that I save the game Boom just like that when the year 540 Let's uh, go ahead and save the game really quick. Let's skip the turn, boys. That was our last turn right here. All right, boom, just like that. Take that. So we get the first, uh, the first assault right here. There we go. We're assaulting them. They've got some minor troops, as you can see. 
Uh, the furthest we go into your territories, the furthest is going to become a problem. But uh, there it is. There's my empire right here that I managed to create, boys. So, after all of that, we're in turn 100. It's time to end it. Uh, that war is going to continue on its own. The uh, Qing Empire is going to Chang Empire is going to have to deal with it by themselves, and uh, that's pretty much it. So, uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to head back in. The Gascony actually managed to take care of the entire Roman situation in um, in Africa, so that's quite interesting. They've got one little territory left. The Romans do. Uh, they did make a comeback in um, Europe, though, so it looks like they might never die. I don't know. I don't know how this is going, but they, they just don't die. They, they're just staying alive. They keep re, uh, retaking lands and stuff like that over and over again. So I might not take Rome, to be honest. I might just take the Bornu or something like that. Uh, we're going to Africa, so we've got plenty of options. I could take the Morse as well. Uh, they're not at war with anybody right now, right? No, they have a truce with Gascony for another 18 turns. Uh, I'll leave it for right now. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.